Hello everybody, welcome to Me Paintings. Greetings to you all the way from the Czech Republic. I'm happy to see you again. I'm Veronica Me, and today I prepared another rainbow painting tutorial for you. So as you can see, I will be using these beautiful rainbow colors. This is genuine yellow light. This is cadmium orange. This one is called cadmium red deep. This one is mauve. Then I've got my permanent violet turquoise. This is pale turquoise and this one is called green one is Viridian Dalo. So these are all the colors which I'll be using today. And as a base, I will be using this titanium white and you need a bunch of it because I will have three big, big canvases which will be connected together and I hope they will create some beautiful rainbow harmony. So that's my white and I mix my colors with pouring medium. This is the consistency of my colors. It's something between thick and thin. It shouldn't be too thick, but also it shouldn't be too thin. Otherwise your colors won't spread out nicely. And I make my own pouring medium from glue and water. I used Kraft PVA glue and I use 60% of PVA glue and 40% of water. That creates my pouring medium. My white base, which I put in this huge plastic cup, my white base is mixture of pouring medium and white acrylic color. And this is 50% of acrylic colors and 50% of pouring medium. I didn't put any silicone in my white at the moment, but I will put two drops of silicone oil in each of my colors. I'm using this one, silicone oil. So two drops in each color. One, two, one, two. I will do the rest, but I wanted to show you that you need to mix it just a little bit, not too much. I hope you can see that and I apologize if my head is in the way. I'm sorry, there is a window in front of my table, so I don't have a really big space, but I hope you will be able to see everything. Now I can start pouring my white. As I said, you need a lot of white for this. So if you find some good deal, then grab it and use your white. So that's done. Now I will pour some white in here where my colors will go. So white in this direction. And I need to keep a little bit of white for later on. And I'm gonna start with my permanent violet. I'll be pouring these blobs, puddles of color here and here, permanent violet, then my mauve, oh sorry you can't see that, no, now you can. My mauve.
I'm going to put a little bit of silicone oil, two drops, in my leftover white and mix it. So let's pour a little bit of that white in here, in this corner. And I'm going to make a huge swipe all up there. I hope you'll be able to see that. Sorry about my head and back. I try to show you as much as I can. So let's start. I'm using this piece of plastic and it's good too for swiping. So gently and I will push all the way up there. It's kind of cool. Look at all these beautiful cells growing. I'm gonna show you a little detail. Wow, look at all these beautiful cells. It looks like a rainbow. I'm going to use my heat gun now because it will create more cells. amazing cells. I'm gonna blow this violet down here because I don't like this white part here so let's try to blow it. And now what am I gonna do? I'm gonna roll this small balloon all the way up there so it creates a beautiful line which will be a perfect background for my marbles or bubbles i don't know i will decide later on and yep now i can roll it all the way up there now look at that look at that beautiful splash of colors I'm going to let this dry for at least a week. It's always better if you wait a little bit longer. And I'm going to show you what to do next. And meanwhile, I'd like to talk about Skillshare, who is a sponsor of today's video. Skillshare is an online learning community where millions come together to take the next step in their creative journey with thousands of inspiring classes for creative and curious people on topics including illustration, design, painting, photography, video and many more. It's for creative and curious people for lifelong learners. Basically, it's for everybody who would like to learn new skills. I've taken class called Illustration and Inspiration, keeping a sketchbook Skillshare Original from Leah Korn. I've always been interested in watercoloring and this class was very helpful for me because not only she was talking about watercoloring, but also about how to sell your art and how to make interesting things from your art for your shop. Skillshare has classes to fit your schedule and skill level, members get unlimited access to thousands of inspiring classes and feedback from a community of millions. Most classes are under 60 minutes with short lessons to fit any schedule. It's curated specifically for learning, meaning there are no ads and they are always launching new premium classes so you can stay focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. It's less than $10 a month with an annual subscription. The first thousands of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a free trial of premium membership so you can explore your creativity. Welcome back. My pour is dry and it turned out really beautiful. I love all these beautiful shapes and shades and colors. As you can see, I turned it upside down because this part is dark and that one is light. So I thought that will be better if the dark part is down and the light part up. And this time I will try to create a beautiful marble effect on my pour because my children, they were 
playing with marbles and I thought, oh, that's beautiful. I could try to paint marble. So this time I will try to paint my beautiful marble acrylic pour. And for that, I'll again, I'll use my plastic cup and also this whiteboard marker, which I bought in a local supermarket. It was cheap, one euro. It won't be visible, but it will help me to see where my beautiful round marbles will be. So I need to make some space for shade because shades will be quite big this time. So maybe here will be my first marble. Like that. Then maybe here my second one. And when I paint something, I always try to examine it quite closely. So I looked at the marble and found out how the shades looks like, where the reflections will be. And I found out if you've got marble, it usually have got this oval shape shade. So I will try to paint my oval shade here. Like that. The shade will be quite big. Like this. I'll be using my titanium white and also Mars black for shading. So I always put a little bit of each color here and then I can start painting. I'll be using these brushes, size 12, 11, 9, these kind of brushes. I think they are called blending brushes, I'm not sure, but they've got tip like this. So now I'm going to use this 11 size and put my brush in a little bit of water and then in my black and start shading. I will make the shades on these edges firstly blend with water I can continue on the top there will be just a little shade on the top and bigger shade on these sides. Now I can continue with this shade. So I will go around the whole, whole shape of my shade, like this. Now, my black is dry, so I can continue with white acrylic and create some sh lighter shades on my marble. So I will create one shade here and shade on this side of my marble. So a little shade here. You need to make sure your black is dry, otherwise you will mix it all together. You don't want that. Now I put my brush in water again 
I will try to blend it like this. And there will also be a light part in my in my ref, in my shade in here. I'm slightly blended. And then in my white, let's create maybe this reflection here. And also some spot, big spot here. second one third one and then I will paint some tiny ones around these big marbles and show you the finished result Here's the result, my marble acrylic pour. And these marbles symbolize my beautiful art journey, which has been such a colorful, joyful experience for me so far. And I love inspiring people around the world. And I feel so grateful that you are watching my videos. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you find my videos inspirational. And if you like it, please give a thumbs up or subscribe to my channel. You can also join my Facebook group, which is called Create With Me and show us your beautiful art. Thank you again for all your positivity and support. I wish you all the best and good health. See you soon. Bye.